Hello guys, what's up? Um, today I'm just going to be showing you how to make a dark trap melody in FL Studio. Uh, I've seen a lot of people overthink this. It's very simple. Um, so yeah, let's just get straight into it. Uh, so for this song, I'm going for uh, almost like Guile. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but Guile Chester by Drake. Um, he uses bells in that song, so that's what we're going to use. And it's a very dark trap song. I tapped to BPM, it's around 128. Um, you never, of course, want to just completely copy a song, but it's going to be kind of similar feel to that. Um, so I have Purity loaded up. Uh, they have really good bells here. I picked this bell. Um, it's a very dark, atmospheric bell, which is what we want. Um, so yeah, let's just get straight into making the melody. So, first thing you want to do is choose a root note. Um, I'm just going to choose one that's sad and has a nice feel to it. Okay, I like F sharp. So, um, next thing we're going to do is map out the scale for F sharp. And... Uh, the way you do that is just to uh, choose the notes which sound best, and um, as you can see, there's half steps here. Half step is just when you go one note up from next without skipping a single one. And those are often what characterize um, trap music a lot, at least to dark trap music. Um, so yeah, we're definitely going to try and involve a lot of those within our melody. So let's get straight into making the melody. Um, I like to do make the scale really big like this, so you have a lot of things to work with. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna get straight into it. So first thing I'm gonna do is, I think I wanna start right here. We're probably gonna make around a four bar melody, so we'll put it over here. And um, yeah, let's just try and find one. And also, it's very uh, common to just have bum, 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 like, you know, just one, two, three, four, one. You know, that's okay. We're gonna try and make we're gonna try and make it a bit more interesting, but if we do end up with that, it's okay. Okay. So I'm trying to make a contrasting melody with these bottom notes. Sorry about that. That was just complete ear ape. Okay, let's turn down the volume on those. Okay, I like that. Um, I'm gonna try and sauce it up a bit more, make it a bit more interesting. I think I'm just gonna leave it like this. 
I like this melody. It's dark. Definitely makes you feel. It's very atmospheric as well. So you know we have our melody, and a lot of producers still have this melody, which they think, oh yeah, it's nice and dark. It's good now. You know I could just add some drums, goddamn beat. But um, what I like to do is try and spice it up a bit. Um, and the first thing I'm gonna do. Well, first of all, I want to make, lengthen these things out to give it a more mysterious, atmospheric vibe. That should be good. And then next, I want to make it a bit longer of a melody, so I'm going to take some things out and add in some. on it and um you know this alone is good as a dark melody but what i really want to try doing is um actually add some growth speed to it i know a lot of people are like oh half speed oh and yeah you know i agree it gets old after a while but it's what so many people use and i'm gonna show you a bit more tricks in here but obviously half speed to make it sound like a banger It might sound trash, I'm not sure. Uh, where is it? Okay. Yeah, okay. That doesn't really sound good. It just sounds weird. Um. That's just one example of ways you can manipulate it. You know, I could always get rid of the reverse, just keep it that way, add a ton of reverb, you know, lower. Give it a try. And you know, that that's like ready to that drum sit basically, you know. Of course you're gonna wanna make contrasting melody. I'm not gonna do that here, but yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I know it's very simple, but I just want to make a video for people who, you know, went into this program and they're like, how the hell am I making, you know, these beats? How am I making an easy melody? I just want a good melody, good dark melody. I hope this helped with that. Um, yeah, stay tuned for more tutorials. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, see ya.